So moving on to box three in the inner box 11 overall. Or I guess pack. I don't know. It's almost the price of a regular, basically the price of a regular box. But hopefully we have good momentum this box. Expecting pretty bad one to kick me down a little bit. So we're going to start with the nine commons as uh, usual. Oh, there's a chatter of squirrel. It's good for to help with all the squirrels that are coming in Modern Horizons 2. Oh, Chromatic Star at Common. That's a decent one as well. We've got Mistress Factory, which is at least playable. Uh, Welding Terror is somewhat playable. Dread Return, somewhat playable. Path to Exile is at least. I don't know. Foil multiplier's never been good on path, but at least the regular is worth three, four dollars. So then the first rare is a Sharoom the Hegemon. Seriously. Seriously. Okay, and then the next rare is Arist the Redeemed. At least that's something. And this is looking pretty bad. We got uh, Urza's Power Plant as the first topper. Then a Mythic at least. Okay, so a Mythic being a Worm Coil engine. Pretty decent one. Probably below average still. There's a lot of the mythics. Like if you average them out, it's over 100. I think this was like 80 bucks, 75 or 80 bucks on the site that I took, that I looked at. So probably a little below the average and lands in the token. So a bit below average, a bit below the price of a pack still, but still better than the stupid Mega Mage ones. <laughs> so I'm not too displeased with this at least. So I thank you for watching and. Thank you for watching and um, hope that you can catch the next one in this run of uh, these stupid shiny boxes that I shouldn't be opening. But uh, thanks again for watching and like, comment, subscribe. Uh, and such so thanks again and uh have a good rest of your day